Turn off the printer and disconnect the power cord and data cables. Connect yourself to an anti-static device. Place the printer on a grounded anti-static mat. Remove the media and ribbon. To remove the front panel, press on the detent button while sliding the panel off the hooks and out of the base. Loosen the two mounting screws about a quarter inch or seven millimeters. Remove the tear plate. Open the peel roller. Insert the peel assembly over the two screws and lift up. Tighten the mounting screws. Slide the lower front panel tabs onto the mounting slots. Snap it into place. Set the cable tie to the tie point. Remove the three screws holding the cover plate to the printer. Remove the cover plate. Remove the shipping tape holding the spindle assembly in place. Slide the liner take-up spindle from the liner take-up assembly. Route the cable under the motor and through the notch and the mounting bracket. Tilt the motor to insert the top of the motor board into the mounting hole. Install the three mounting screws. Connect the cable to the 10-pin connector. Wrap the cable tie around the cable. Slide the liner take-up spindle onto the shaft of the liner take-up motor. Install the E-ring. Load the media and ribbon. Open the peel assembly. Pull the media labels out about 12 inches or 300 millimeters. Peel the labels off the liner. Feed the liner into the peel assembly. Locate the notch on the spindle. Insert the liner under the notch and around the spindle. Turn several times to secure the liner. Close the peel assembly. Reconnect the power cord and data cables. Turn on the printer. Set the printer to peel off mode. Press home on the display. Press OK. Press the right arrow six times to go to print mode. Press the down arrow once to go to peel mode. Press home twice. Press feed.